<sighs> Did we lose them? Yeah, I think we lose. I think we lost. I think we lost him. Like zoinks, that was close, man. Still, why would the ghost of of Skeleton Steven want to scare everyone from Atatash? Like I think me and Scoob found it, figured it out. Plus, we found a badge, a police badge with the letters D D with two D's on it, and we found the three sacks of money Skeleton Steven stole years ago. We think, for once, about not thinking about food, we think that Skeleton Steven is scaring everyone away from Atatash to protect his money he stole. Shaggy, for once, you're right. And also, he wants to use the money he stole to buy stuff, like food. Shaggy! Raggy! Like what? Wait, did you say you found a police badge with the letters DD on it? Yeah, like... Deputy Don. Hmm. Deputy Don. Sheriff Don! But Sheriff Don can't be the ghost. Sheriff Buzz is the ghost. Like, are you sure? Someone must have put the, that badge to make everyone think that Sheriff Don did it. Okay, gang, I think it's about time we capture the ghost of Skeleton Steven. And plus, we already know who it is. We know who Skeleton Steven's ghost is. That's great, Fred, because I have a plan. And for once, I'm not going to foil it like I did with the Luna Ghost case, Velma. So tell us your plan. Okay, huddle up. Okay. Here's the plan. We're gonna... We're gonna grab a net, a net and a rope from the mystery machine, and then I'll tell the rest later. Alright. Here's the plan. When Shaggy and Scooby lure the ghost here, past the mystery machine, Fred... He will, he will trip over this wire, I mean rope, rope, I meant rope, and then Fred will drop the net on him. And then we'll tie him up, and we got him. Like, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Like, there is no way you're going to make me and Scooby lower the ghost here. Ra, row, way, row, row. There is nothing you can say or do to make us be live bait, like always. Oh, I can think of something. You wouldn't dare. Would you do it? Don't say it for a Reese Row, Scooby Snack. Stand for oh, buddy. We are not going to fall for it. We've heard will you do it for a Scooby Snack hundreds and thousands of times. Two Scooby Snacks? Uh uh we have our dignity. Like we are United Front and you will never break us. Three Scooby Snacks. Fine, okay, we'll do it. Just give us three Scooby Snacks after we, after we catch the ghost. <laughs> we'll do it. I'm raw weak. Like I'm so weak too. <laughs> Come on Scooby Doo, we better do as we're told. A deal's a deal. Wait for me. Come on, Daphne. You keep an eye out for Scooby and Shaggy. Okay, Velma. I knew the Scooby Snack thing would make them do it. Like always. <laughs> Like, I always have a bad feeling about this, Scoob. Rai, roo, roo. Hey, like, there he is. 
Hey, Skeleton Steven! Huh? You two! I told you to get off the mountain, but you didn't listen. I told you to leave, but you didn't listen. And now I'm really going to capture you and make you pay! Ha 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 ha! Like, and away we go! Rikes! <laughs> I think I hear them coming! Like, get ready! Rikes! Boing! Boing. Here he comes, gang. Get ready. Ha 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 ha. Now. Bang. Throw the net, Fred. Throw the net. Got it. Quick gang, tie him up before he escapes. Okay, tie it, tie him up. We got him, we got him, we got him. Tie him up, tie him up. Grab the rope. Fred, use the rope, use the rope. I got him, I got him. We got him. Now let's head back to the, to the hotel and show Mr. Donald, Sheriff Don, and Mayor Lucy. Like, wait, bam. Where'd Shaggy go? Robert row. After we do the wrap up, we should take these back to the bank. And show this badge too. Where is that badge with the two Ds, Shaggy? Like, it's in my shirt. I didn't want to lose it. Oh. Well, let's get back to the hotel. Wait till Mayor Lucy, Mr. Donald, and Sheriff Don sees this. Wow, way to go, kids. And hey, you found the three stolen sacks of money. I'll call the bank right after this. And you caught the ghost of Skeleton Steven. Great work, kids. You're welcome, Mayor Lucy. This is Rebecca Reven reporting live at the Atatash New Hampshire Resort, which some teenager, teenager kids, investigators, aka Mystery Inc., just solved the case. Excuse me, Mr. Fred Jones, can you please tell everyone out there how you solved the case? I think you're gonna, well, you're gonna have to wait for that, Miss Reven. Because it's time to reveal you know who. Right, Velma? Right, Fred. Now, let's see who the ghost of Skeleton Steven really is. Wait, who is it? Well, well, Shaggy. All the clues fitted. We just had the we just needed time to fit them together. So the skel the ghost of skeleton Steven is as you were saying, Fred. As I was saying, let's try this again. Let's see who the ghost of skeleton Steven really is. Da -na -na. Deputy Buzz! <gasps> Deputy Buzz, you are my partner. How could you? Why? Now I feel ashamed of Now I feel so ashamed because of you. That's right. He lied that he was going to go back to the station, but he was actually going to the woods with the sacks of money. I'm not telling you why I did it. I'm keeping my mouth S H U T. Ugh, so rude.
Okay, now can you tell us how you solved the case, Mr. Fred Jones? Sure. Velma? Well, first I couldn't figure out why Skeleton Steven wanted everyone to leave Adatash. But then I needed some time to figure it out. And I'll, and I'll be happy to tell you. Music, please. Da, na, na, na. Da, na, na, na. Da, na, na. Da, I knew there was something weird going on the minute we met Mr. Donald, Sheriff Don, and Deputy Buzz. At the party, when we weren't looking, Deputy Buzz went outside and turned on the fan with the stinky cheese. And that's what made the weird smell. Go, in, go into the tent. And also when we weren't looking again, he, he made the lights glitch by dropping two axes on the power lines from the generators to make the lights go out. And also when we, were look, when we weren't looking, 